what hardware do I need in order to use Jacktrip? Do I need to buy some magic box in order to achieve ultra low latency or not? You don't. However, there are a few things that come in handy and they also depend on what quality you want, of course. The number one thing I'm gonna say is you need a computer and we assume that most of you have a working computer. Um, it doesn't need to be an incredibly powerful computer. It could be an average computer or laptop uh, in order to use Jacktrip. What we do recommend is that you buy an ethernet cable that you connect to your router or your modem and then into your computer, right? And maybe if you have a MacBook, for example, like I do, you will need a adapter to go from USB-C to ethernet and then bridge that to the modem. If you want good quality, we obviously recommend that you have a decent microphone. In my case, uh, I'm using a large condenser diaphragm microphone here, um, which is great for vocals, but you could go with any cheap option or you could even use your built-in laptop uh, microphone if you want to test things out for now. If you do get a decent uh, microphone, you might want to get an audio interface as well, which is how I'm also connecting uh, my microphone here. You can see that I have this interface and I've plugged my microphone into it. If you're a drummer and you want stereo sound, right? You want two microphones, you could, um, you could get two microphones and uh, we support stereo as well. So for any external microphone, uh, most of the time you need an audio interface, but there are also microphones that plug directly into your computer with USB um, and they act as their own audio interface. So that might be something worth considering. Um, down in the description, by the way, I'll put a few links to common microphones that are affordable if you just want to start with a, with a microphone for recording your voice, for example. If you have a guitar or a keyboard or something like that, um, that usually also has an output that you could just plug into your audio interface. So that is uh, your destination for all the external microphones and then that has an analog to digital converter that goes into your computer. Um, so you could get anything uh, that you like um, for your specific use case. What we do recommend is that you use headphones. Now headphones are important because if I wear these, I can hear everybody else uh, through my headphones and it doesn't feed back into my microphone, right? So um, any headphones will do, just do not use Bluetooth uh, headphones because there is a lot of additional latency. So make sure that you use wired headphones, okay? Um, and you could plug those into your audio output from your computer or you could plug that into the audio output from your audio interface. So that is also entirely up to you. Back in the days, we used to sell these Jector bridges, which was essentially a little computer on its own that was serving as an audio interface and as an ethernet port. So you could connect that and then connect your microphone to that. But um, I think it just makes sense to, to get this stuff on your own if you don't already have it. Um, so you have more flexibility. And so you literally just need the Jacktrip software, uh, install it on your computer, connect the ethernet cable, um, connect your headphones and ideally a decent microphone. And that's how you can send and receive high quality audio through Jacktrip.